This is a really dynamic core workout. We're gonna be doing a lot of great exercises. So get started with our plank walkout. Feet are wide, lift your arms up, bend your knees, take your hands to the floor, walk out into a plank position, hold for a second, bend the knees, and walk back all the way up to standing. So again, take the fingertips to the floor, walk it out, hold, and push back. This is a great exercise because it's not only a core exercise, it's total body. You're working lower body and the upper body. Let's keep it going. Our next exercise is called soldier kicks. Legs come up, arms go across. Try to keep your legs straight, but you can have a slight bend in the knee if you're not very flexible, that's fine. This really engages those lower ab muscles, but the great thing is you'll feel the backs of your legs and your hamstrings working too. You'll feel the muscles in the side of your body working. This is a wonderful exercise to work your core and also a great one to do before you go out for a run. Our next exercise is called a figure eight. You wanna be in a slight squat position, clasp your hands together. You're gonna to sweep down, up and around, like you're making a figure eight. This exercise is wonderful because it's working your oblique muscles and really challenging those outer core muscles. The great thing about being in a slight squat position is that you're working your booty too. Keep it going. Now let's take it to the floor for our bicycle abs. So what you're gonna do is you're just gonna lay flat, hands are behind the head, start both feet up. You're gonna switch sides, opposite arm to opposite knee. 
This is great because it activates all the muscles in your core, phenomenal for your hip flexors, and great for your obliques. Really working on those side ab muscles. Extending that leg out. Three, two, one, rest. Our next exercise, well, all you're gonna do is I want you to sit back, lift both feet off the floor. You can support your body weight on your hands. Touch your heels and back. Touch and then come back. Really controlling the core. Great job, you made it through your core workout.